Hi guys, welcome to Zell's YouTube channel. We at Zell have been training thousands of students for several courses like ACCA, USCPA, CMA and CFA. So today I will be discussing a very interesting concept of risk, systematic and unsystematic risk. Today as we speak, there's a war going on in some part of the world. There is a pandemic floating around somewhere. So if you look at it, if you look at the market today, if you look at all the industries, there are these factors which affect the working of every industry out there. Be it someone in the pharma sector, be it someone in FMCG, be it someone in the hospitality sector. What happens is there are certain risks in the market which affect every single type of business irrespective of what sector they are operating into that is known as systematic risk on the other hand there are certain risks which are very sector specific or very company specific for example tomorrow you know there's a certain kind of awareness about people consuming vegan food then companies which are into processed milk products are going to suffer some sort of a negative uh, change in their growth negative earnings so basically these factors affect only certain industries when the pandemic hit and it hit hard the entire hospitality sector was in a way wiped out but at the same time the ott platforms which were delivering content to consumers like you and me grew by leaps and bounds so pandemic became an unsystematic risk for a particular kind of business why because it affected one particular industry or one particular sector more so today if you have to invest let's again you know i think all financial management experts basically drew their wisdom from old english sayings as they say don't put all your eggs in one basket that is what financial management experts are also saying do not invest all your money in one kind of companies so if you are investing in a company which is in the sector of hospitality uh, and at the same time you are investing in a company which is in the pharma sector god forbid there is a fourth wave of the pandemic which hits so again you will be locked in your homes there will be no tourism so companies which are in that area are going to suffer a dip in earnings and your share prices will go down but the demand demand for you know your medicines your vaccines your other uh, immunity factors will go up which will kind of fuel the growth of pharma companies so their share prices will begin to rise what is happening here is because you have a diversified portfolio one company is going through its bad days or bad phase where the share prices are dropping but you have invested in another kind of company whose share price because of the same set of reasons it is not getting affected and the loss that you are suffering or the wealth erosion that you are suffering in one is kind of compensated through the positive upward growth in another stock so what unsystematic risk points to is it is a risk which affects a specific sector a specific business as smart investors what you should be doing is you should be diversifying your portfolio do not invest in one kind of stock the systematic risk on the other hand affects everyone the war that i spoke of at the beginning is affecting everyone and the entire market is plummeting that is systematic risk which affects everyone unsystematic risk is something which affects a particular sector or a particular industry if you like the video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe thank you